Hi there. Now we are exploring the interior of Anthropus HK3. Inside, there are two racks that organize and house the miners. Anthropus HK3 has a rack capacity of up to 210 ant miner hydrocooling units. The miners can be easily accessed and managed for repairs or updates. If you look closely, you can notice the tubing from where the coolants pass through. They are color coded to indicate the temperature of liquids passing. The blue label indicates the cooled coolant is flowing in, and the red labeling indicates that the heated coolant is flowing out. The heated coolant will circulate and will be cooled through the cooling process. Behind here, we have a few modules that manage the system. This is a coolant distribution unit, which pumps liquid across the entire container. This is an expansion tank, which protects close water systems from excessive pressure. This is a coolant reserves tank, which maintains coolant levels across the entire container. This is the central control cabinet. This cabinet houses the various sensor control systems. You can monitor and inspect other systems seeing the water temperature or water pressure. This is a power distribution cabinet which provides power supply and redistribution of electrical energy. It provides protection against the overload and short circuit currents keeping miners safe. The cooling process starts as a cooled coolant enters the miners. It effectively transfers the heat, maintaining and cooling operations. The coolant then makes its way across the piping system, flowing to the cooling tower. As mentioned previously, the cooling tower would then cool the coolant the spray and air cooling method, dissipating the heat of the coolant back to a temperature of 35 degrees Celsius. The style of aspect is to free and hydrocooling mines running together. If you hear it from here, most of the sound is coming from the coolant management system. Now let's go back to the front. If you notice here, I don't know if you can hear this, but there's little no sound coming from the miners, only the sound of flowing water, which sounds really nice.